Hi YouTube, Miss Glamour Girl 79 here coming back um to you to do a review on this kiss oh, it's new kiss eyelashes with applicator string. Um I know it's been a couple of weeks since I've um made a video I was supposed to do a tutorial on this like right after I made my last video but a lot had happened um, I got really really ill and had to be hospitalized and I had thought it was my appendix well comes to find out after lots and lots of tests lips dry that I um, had a cyst on my right ovary which had ruptured which was causing me to be in a lot of pain and when I say pain I'm not talking about like oh my stomach hurts no oh pain like oh I can't walk it hurts that bad so and when the doctor told me I was like okay my ovaries caused all this pain so apparently this cyst had gotten so big to the point where when it ruptured all the blood collected and a lot of other technical stuff I don't want to get into right now and plus on top of that I have a fibroid in my uterus that's like growing so it took me a week to you know get back to myself then I had to take care of stuff around the house and my family and my kids and stuff so you know all part of being a woman I'm wearing a um, three day old twist out it's looking kind of rough so I just pinned it's a part right here so I just pinned this side and this side so you know it is what it is also um, I'm gonna do the wet and wild palette tutorial that I was supposed to um, do also with this kiss uh, review and in my, if you watch my last video I had two of these and I did the number one I did not like number one because not because it was easy very easy to put them on but the lashes were so long to when I looked up the lashes was touching my eyebrows that's not natural so I decided to you know take them off I think I slept in them and then I just decided to take them off they were just it was just a weird feeling so let's get started um excuse my lighting I'm trying to get it correct, so I'm sitting by the window. And the stuff in the background, you know, I was doing some laundry, you know. So let's get started. Here are the um, eyelashes. These are the number two. Oh, my nails look a little rough. I need a manicure. But that's the number two. Hopefully these aren't, like, super, super long. I don't want to look like a baby cow, so... This is the glue. The glue works really, really good. It dries clear. It's it gets really sticky, but not to the point where you feel the stickiness on your eyelashes. Also, um, I have my work look that I did today, which was with the naked palette. I think that smog and buck and a little bit of sin under my eyebrow. So we're gonna I'm just gonna do one because I'm pressed for time. But this is how they look. I'm gonna take them out. When you take these out, try to be careful you don't pull the red string out because that is what helps you to apply them to your lashes. So usually I would clean my face and not do this with um, makeup on. But I'm getting ready to take a shower and wash my hair. So it'll be okay. So first of all, this is out of the package. Okay. Let me turn this TV down a little bit. Watching a little bit of Walton's. <laughs> I know it's really old fashioned, but that's me. I like old fashioned stuff. I watch a lot of old movies. 
um, both black and white, you know. I think those movies really had something to say compared to the movies of today. You know, a lot of the movies are really violent and, you know, you know how it is. So, this is how it looks, the glue. It's white. So, basically, let me set this down. You're going to just, it has a tip at the end. So, you're going to take that tip and drag it across. Like so. And you don't have to use much. So now what you want to do is kind of, I like to bend it. Wait a couple of seconds until it gets uh, kind of sticky and tacky. Right now it's like a little too liquidy. So I blow on it. Where's my mirror? Okay, I'm going to use my mirror. I always handheld mirror. I can't do without it because I need to get close up to my face to see what I'm doing. I need glasses or something. I don't know. I'm getting old. Everything's failing me. So, okay. So, we should have enough lighting. It should be enough time to pass. I'm like, oh, discombobulated. But okay. Here we go. I have three minutes to do this. So I'm looking in my mirror over here. Okay. So basically, you hold this up to your eye and you're just going to place it. So I have it on there. I want to hold it there for a few seconds. And there. So I know you can see, let me get closer, the strings. So you're going to wait till it dries. I want to say maybe about 30, 40 seconds. And during this time, you could just be pressing with your finger, pressing the eyelash down to make sure it adheres to the skin. And the reason why I like these because it does not get in the way of your own eyelashes. It kind of pushes them out of the way. So I'm going to just... And it's already drying. So I'm going to take one side out. See how that does. You know, just tap it with your, your fingers and just to keep it in place. So in order to take it out, you put one finger wherever you're going to start at and just pull one end of the string. Okay, so... Oh. Okay, so There. Let me see if you can see this. So, that's one eyelash. And it goes on pretty good. So, you know, it's very easy, very convenient. So, that's my tutorial for today. I will come back um, to you with a review of the Wet n Wild, the two Wet n Wild palettes that I purchased um, a couple of weeks ago. Um, so, bye-bye for now. Rate, comment, and subscribe, and tell me how you like. Bye.